All right. First of all, I hope you all did really well on your Chapter 3 test. I hope everything was easy for you. It should have been. We went over it enough times. But now, it's on to Chapter 4. What's the connection? I want you to get ready because tomorrow when you come to class, bring your colored markers. I'm going to have some poster paper for you. And we are making posters tomorrow in class. What you're trying to do is you're going to take, and I'm just going to kind of highlight one here for us. Let's see here. Let's grab that. We'll grab that. Let's give it a nice pretty color. Oh, hello, line styles. There we go. Let's give it a nice, bold, fluorescent green. Ho, oh, ho, ho. Yeah, now you can see exactly what I'm looking at. Right there. All right. So, if we were to look at this pattern right here, and some of you will have this, so I'm not going to really help you too much. What you're going to do is you're going to be describing all sorts of information. Okay? You're going to look at this pattern. You're going to be able to tell me what would figure zero look like. You're going to tell me what figure, you're going to draw out what figure zero will look like as well. So figure zero, you'll draw out figure four and figure five. Eh, I think that's good enough. Zero, four, five. So on your poster, you're also going to include one, two, and three, which is fine. But you're also going to include what figure four, uh, figure zero will look like and figures four and five will look like. Then on your poster, I want you to write down descriptions of this and tell me what is happening. What growth patterns are you seeing? Is there anything staying constant? Um, um, is anything being growing by exponentially? And how can you tell? And how do you represent that? You're also going to tell me on your poster what figure 100 will look like. No, you don't have to draw it. But you will describe it. You'll describe it in detail. There will be this many going this way. There will be this many going this way. There will be this many up in this corner. Oh, there's an extra row of this. Whatever it might be, you're going to tell me and describe what figure 100 will look like. And you will tell me how many tiles are in figure 100. That means you probably want to have a rule that goes along with that. So within your description, you should have described, oh, the rule for this one will be y equals x squared plus 2x minus 3, or whatever that rule comes out to be. You're going to figure that out, and you're going to include that information. You have the entire class hour to do this poster. You're going to work hard. You're going to come into class ready to go, work hard, get that done. Hopefully that explains what you're doing tomorrow. Look forward to seeing you. Please come prepared, and we'll see you tomorrow.